To prevent shoplifting, we are seeing more and more drugstores like CVS and Walgreens lock up basic products like deodorants, soap, and cosmetics. And Custom Made is a company focused on revolutionizing retail shopping for both the customer and the retailer, uh, one cart at a time. So joining me now is the company's chief marketing officer, Yaniv Zuckerman. Uh, thank you so much for joining. And um, we've seen a lot of these stores, like I mentioned, take different precautions, obviously amid COVID, trying to prevent shoplifting. How effective are you finding that method? So, hi, Kristen, and thanks for having me. It's a pleasure being here. Uh, yeah, you know, I've been visiting a lot of stores in the United States and other countries, uh, and I've met all those uh, locked up uh, products, and it's it's not it's not a pleasant uh, uh, experience for for me, and I guess for all other shoppers. And I do think it's not an effective way to mitigate uh, to fight shoplifting, because eventually uh, it it's hurting the bottom line. It's uh, first. It deters uh, customers away. It produces a lot of friction into the process, uh, and it's steering uh, customers away from actually buying those products. So uh, it's it's a lose-lose situation eventually. How does your company's smart cart technology then, uh, Yanni, address this issue of theft while enhancing the shopper experience? Great question. Uh, this is uh, the holy grail eventually. So first. Uh, our focus is first and foremost on, on the customer experience. Uh, we, uh, our carts are designed with with the end customer in mind, uh, helping both the retailers, our direct customers, and the and the shoppers, to to get to a win-win situation. Um, so. Uh, it improves their their experience, the shopping experience from this from the moment they get into the store until they leave the store. Our carts actually uh, serves as a kind of a shopping companion for them, um, helping them through the, throughout their the shopping journey and eventually uh, bypassing uh, uh, the lines, uh, long lines at the checkout because checkout is being done at the at the at the cart. But we all know that uh, shoplifting and uh, and even honest mistakes are a big big issue, and we do this by uh, uh, providing uh, five layers of technology within our cart that uh, ensures that every uh, product that is being put into the cart is being recognized, identified, and added to the cart, and added to the bill, and eventually is being paid off. No extra and no less. Mm -hmm. Walk me through the five layers of security equipped in some of these carts and how they do protect stores from theft. So uh, those technologies are both physical technologies, but also AI-based technologies. So we combine what we call this five layer of protection. It's a combination of uh, barcode scanner to scan the code, a computer vision uh, backed uh, camera that identifies uh, uh, expensive products, uh, an RFID reader that also can identify and read uh, pot particular products that have been deemed more, more, more theft driven. Uh, a, a security scale at the bottom of the cart that ha weighs every every product being inserted into the cart and make sure that this is the right product by checking the, the, the weight of the product. And eventually, on top of everything, we have an, an AI-based uh, software that uh, monitors the transactions and monitors the activities and uh, flags, identifies and flags uh, anomalous types of behaviors and activities that can be addressed and targeted to, to the employees at the stores, and they can go and check what is going on and remedy any, any situation. How, does, how do the security features, Yanni, have worked together to ensure the real accuracy of product recognition and tracking? So uh, the first, the first uh, stage uh, in, the, in the shopping experience is to log in and then either with your loyalty card or with your phone number. And then you start doing your, shopper, your shopping. You just add products to, to the cart. You scan them uh, immediately when you scan them. Uh, and our carts are connected to the point of sale systems of, of, of our custom, retail customers. And then it's being placed at the cart. The cart weighs the product and identifies and cross checks that this is the right weight that is corresponding with this product. On top of that, all, all products being inserted in the card are being uh, uh, imaged through our uh, computer vision uh, based cameras. And if there is a discrepancy there, it will flag and it will stop 
uh, it will stop the, uh, uh, the transaction and will raise a, a notification to the customer. Hey, there is something wrong. Maybe you forgot to place the, car, the item or maybe you put the wrong item. Please take the item outside and put the right item. So we converse with the customer in order to close this issue immediately at the, at the, at the, um, at the cart. And eventually, uh, when, they, when they are done with their shopping, you see that all items are there, that the prices are right, that the discounts are right, and only then they can proceed to checkout, which is again be being done on the, on the actual cart. How does CustomAid's platform blend online and physical shopping experiences, and how is that beneficial? So, um, we really see ourselves as a, as a company that introduces or enables our retail customers to introduce uh, 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 the online shopping experience at the physical store. Basically, uh, the way uh, our users are, are, are using the, the cart is very similar to the experience they, they do when, when they do the online shopping at the, at the retailers' websites, e-commerce websites. Uh, same information, same additional services. They can also in, get uh, um, uh, suggestions on additional products. Uh, they can get uh, coupons. They can use their coupons. They can use. Uh, they can get special offers. They can be exposed to advertisements which are targeted specifically for them. It's very similar to the experience that you have on any online uh, uh, online e-commerce site. Uh, but the best thing that eventually you can sense the the, the product, you can feel the product, you can touch the product because you are at the store and you go away home immediately with your, with your shopping cart and with your items. So it's immediate gratification. And how does CustomAid's modular cart system try to lower costs, minimize some of these space requirements and really reduce energy consumption versus a traditional cart? So uh, the first generation of, of carts, both for us, for customers, and for many of our competitors, were, were fully integrated carts, very big, very bulky, and eventually very expensive and heavy, uh, both on the, the power consumptions and actual weight. And um, they did a fantastic job, but they were too, too cumbersome, too big. They, 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 they've taken too much of uh, space at the store. And some of them, you could not even take them out of the store. We came with the next, with the new generation. Our, our 3.0 generation of smart cart is completely modular. Uh, we are uh, providing a kit which encompasses a smart panel, which is basically uh, basically the, the the cart and the security scale. And we can retrofit any existing shopping cart that the, it's part of uh, of the fleet of of the customers um, with our kit. So. It's, we, we've been able to reduce costs down, to shrink everything in terms of size, of scale, of weight, and also power consumption, and also to, to uh, be a very, very much effective in terms, in terms of the space that we actually uh, need, because this, the carts could be, uh, the regular carts, they can be outside of the store, no need for extra space within the store. Oh. So everything is much more streamlined and, uh, and efficient. How do your carts offer a comprehensive security solution uh, really to make sure that that security is in place? So as I mentioned, uh, we, we have a lot of the five layers of security uh, which are being uh, operated throughout the shopping process. But then there are additional layers that uh, make sure that actually you pay uh, at the end of your, of your visit and to make sure that you're not going out without paying and with the equipment. Uh, so for example, we make sure that eventually in order to pay, you need to scan a specific code uh, at a certain point and only then you can, you can pay. You will pay on the cart, but you can't go out of the store without, being, without paying first for, for all your, your, your items. And even if you've paid for, uh, for the items, we, we, uh, we make sure that you are not going away entirely with the cart. Uh, by having a, another technology that senses if you're uh, going out throughout a certain perimeter and it enables us to uh, identify this and lock the wheels of the stores. But there are other, other types of technologies that can be, uh, can be used in order to protect the equipment and not only the transactions. Yanni Zuckerman, Chief Marketing, Marketing Officer of Customate. Yanni, thank you.